Hello, everyone. RBG Kingdom Kid here, back with some more Octopath Traveler 2. In the previous video, we went and uh, we saw Thorne's uh, end of her chapter, and now we're gonna go get our seventh character. That's right. When it gets dark in this area, the black market opens up. Oh, you don't say. The fuck? Wake up. Or be hunted. Prepare yourself. Alrighty. So I did do some what off-screen grinding. Do? Not, uh, not a lot of it. I mean, I think I did a decent amount of it. Um. Here we go. But it's really hard because I don't want to do a lot of grinding until after I get all my characters, which we should Thunder hopefully. Soon. Here I go. I think I used ice on these things before. This will cool it <laughs> Now it begins. Right, get rid of you. Ready? No, nope, God. God damn it. Oh well. Uh, okay. We are gonna make our way. Oh, is this the black market? Come and get me. My turn. Right. Hmm. Here I come. My turn. Now it begins. This sucks because like, there's no. Ready? <laughs> My prey awaits. Here. Here. Grab one. Ow. Here we go. Now. Ready? End this. There's no need for flattery. It'll rust my sword. Nice. Also, I want to wait until we're also in better areas, too. Bottle of blinding dust, poison dust, befuddling dust. Bottle of nightmares? The hell is that? It looks poison, blindness, confusion, and sleep on a single foe with a given pro. Damn. Ooh, you should sell the stones, which wouldn't be so bad. I probably should just buy some of those. All right, but we're on our way to the abandoned village. Huh. Oh. There's no enemies here either. Why don't you buy something? I'll sell it to you for cheap. There's nothing more I can do. A man who happened upon the village during a long journey, he was the first one to find it devastated. But anyone else to help, he buried all the villagers and prayed for their repose. It took him more than ten days. What the fuck? Feathered hat, feather mantle, rosemary redemption? Why would anyone want that? Traveler, what can I do ye for? 
Oh, you're the tavern. Oh. Whoa. Well, I get the feeling that this is a ghost town at night, and that dude that we first saw was a ghost. Can't just barge into other people's houses. Get out! Maybe a level 30? Nick's royal family tree. The Nick's family tree shows the lineage of the royal family that ruled the northern region of the Brightlands. Huh. Need about level 30 in order to get it from him. Okay. Interesting. That is interesting. Okay, let's get these guys back in here just for a little bit. Just so Thorn... Thorn I definitely needs to get some leveled up. And Ocheta... That one hurt. I, I, I'd like to get him to at least level 15. Ooh. Excuse me, what? Uh, uh, what now? <laughs> Hold on. Where the fuck am I supposed to go? I am going the wrong way. How the hell do I get? Do I just go? I guess I go that way. You know what? Fuck it. I'm just going fast travel here. And then I'll go all the way that way. <sighs> Time to clean up the filth. Well now. Well now. Okay. Oh, there's their skill. Get rid of the bard. Cool now. My prey away. Let me just finish this. My turn. Cleaning time. <laughs> what to do? Here I Here we go. 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 Here Here Iron blade. Neat. Worse than clock blink high road. So I'm not going to clock break. I want to go north. I 
I mean, we could go to new clockwork so then I can just fast travel to the place, but... Be hunted. Eh, that wouldn't be fun. Here I come. Well now. Ready? My turn. There. Here we go. Prepare yourself. Here I go. How dare you? How dare you? Expertly done, Throne. My turn. I fight for my turn. It's over. Sorry, but I won't hurt Uh, oh yeah, and then also I gave some skills to Thorne as well, um, with her job skills and everything like that, because I now believe that they are like, what are you looking at? Level 40? Beast liver, polar ice. I have a rook 50. What do you have? A soldier who breaks the regulations of his outfit by coming to stand here every night. If his unauthorized, nonchalant outings come to light, punishment will be swift and unavoidable. But that only heightens the thrill and makes it harder to stop. He sounds and looks like a woman, but is a man. Interesting. Okay. That is interesting. Hunt or be hunted. My turn. Ah. I was about to say, does he stand up there as a dress in his normal uniform then? Does not seem to be the case. Eastern Flame Church Pass. This is where we need to go. I see over there, chest. Oh, that looks like a little pass there too, but oh well. Ah. Poison that must be perfect. What the begins. hell? My turn. Right. Can we the daggers? What to do? The daggers, okay. What to do? Thunder Birdie! Impressive, Ochet. Full arms. My turn. This'll cool you down. Now that. Let's go! Mahina! Mahina! Ah, it was a week to win. Okay. Now it begins. I fight for my friends. Oh, Mountain 8. Okay, I was like... Over. Fuck you. <laughs> Here I come. These hands. My so, journey will not staff end. then? Because I think that's the only weapon we've never had. I think we tried all the other weapons. If I'm being completely honest, I cannot wait until we get Oswald. 
Because I love the Scholar in the first game. I loved Cyrus. And I honestly just can't wait to play uh, him, like, play that guy again. If he has the skill that uh, Cyrus had where you see a weakness every turn, at least one, he is going to be on the team forever until we get all the team people. Oh, it's literally the first thing that happens when we come into town. Show yourself, cleric. We want to render our judgment in person. What's going on? We understand you've been spreading some fantasy about a sacred flame, and we won't stand for it. We are the truth. <sighs> well, this is quite the scene. I've already driven them off once, but I see they haven't learned their lesson. A lesson they won't learn if I leave them be. Would you mind assisting me? I promise I mean you no harm. Sure. Ah, that is a great help. I feel the light of the sacred flame shining upon me. That was in the first game. So the cleric's not the only sacred flame worshiper, huh? That's just as well. We'll rid this place of as many of you as we have to. What? Come and get me. Well now. Prepare yourself. What to do? Right. Yes. What to do? There. What to do? What to do? This'll cool you down. Here I come. I still have much to learn. That's a good amount of money we got. Impossible. You are quite the capable companion. Yes, very reliable. Forgive me for not introducing myself. I am Temenos. As Temenos. you can see, I am a cleric. I was just about to set off on a journey. You see, I'm investigating something. In fact, in lieu of thanks, how about I join you on your journey? Yes. <laughs> I am honored. Temonis has joined the party. The party will be temporarily dissolved, and chapter one of Temonis' tale will begin. Even if you choose no, you can still hear the story later by visiting the local tavern. Let's continue. Or start. Long ago, darkness and confusion reigned. The hearts of the people ran over with wickedness. The world seemed eager to greet its end. Then eight gods assembled, and with the sacred flame brought light to the world. Was that the same story from the first game, or is this referencing the first game? That'd be great. Oh, Elfric. Whoa, 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 whoa. The day is wicked. Elfric? I think that was the name of one of the... I th was that the name of the Archmage? I think Elric was one of the names of one of the um, the uh, one of the guys that we had to fight for one of the secret. I don't want to call they were secret classes, but like one of the uh, one of the big classes in the first game. I think that was the case. We give our power Vide. to you. You must stop, V Day. Or V Day. I'm actually quite curious if the mobile game of Octop the mobile Octopath Traveler game has any ties into this in any way, shape, or form. I think that was actually about the first four people. Rest well, my fellow gods. Alfred the Flamebringer? Yeah, no, he was in the first game for sure. Darkness. I'm 100% sure. Truth 
lies in the flame. In the flame! And we're controlling him. Ooh. Fide. Fide. Do you truly mean to enshroud us in shadow? Now I am become chaos. Devourer of all Jack Garland? in this world. Even you, foolish gods. All shall be mine. And uh, now... You have made your choice, Vide. The end is near. And so I face... And now my righteous flame the final shall turn curtain. you to ash. <laughs> Flames aid me. <laughs> what the fuck? 99. Oh my god. Hold on. God skills. Alfred's blessing. Grant yourself all attribute rising effects for nine turns. Deal to single foe three times, okay? May the sacred flame guide me. <laughs> you will atone for your sins. You will atone for your sins. Flames aid me. You will atone for your sins. I can't even like boost my skills. Is this the best you can do, Elfrey? Enough of this fool. Look, this ends up being like the thing that ties all the stories together right here. I That'd shall be devour you. Well. Dark calamity. You cannot possibly hope to best me. See how the light fades from this world. <sighs> no. What did you say? I said no, bitch. The flame has been entrusted to me. From its humble light shall a fire be lit. Shining its light upon the darkness. I fight in me yet. Divine resolve. With only a seven hit attack on a single foe with the help of your fellow gods. My fellow gods. Illuminate the shadow. I am eternal. That was awesome. I will engulf this world through the malice of the people. Burn bright, O oh sacred flame, from our hearts. From our hearts. Uh, uh, what was my line again? What was the next line? Oh my god! <laughs> I was joking! I was joking! Um, what was the next line? Wait, what? Is this a play? This is a play? Burn bright, O oh sacred flame, from our hearts. Ah, oh, shit. From our hearts. <laughs> what was the next line? <laughs> you forgot. It's dried the shadows from our hearts. Ah, yes. My apologies. 
You've a fine memory, young man. Okay, this is sweet. <laughs> Everyone knows how that part goes, Temenos. Oh, I guess except not me. Get your own performance right. <laughs> <clears throat> now then, with that foible behind me. Elfric's flames consumed the wicked V-Day. And disaster was averted. The eight gods, their power drained, fell into a long slumber. They then became the sacred flame that keeps the darkness at bay. And thus, the people continue to live in light and warmth. For the sacred flame ever shines upon them. That was pretty good, Temenos. Except for the lines you forgot again. Again? <laughs> You're quite a demanding audience. <sighs> when are you going to commit the story to memory, Temenos? Do get a hold of yourself, Inquisitor. I shall, Mint. Now, here are your candles of the sacred flame. Return to your homes, light them, and open your hearts. Let their warm glow illuminate every corner of your souls. Thanks, Sister Mint. I like your hair ornament. <laughs> Why, thank you. We are all born with shadow inside us. Shadow manifests in our worst instincts. Anger, hatred, resentment, and jealousy, to name a few. But the sacred flame drives these shadows away, leading us to the light. Hello. It's the Pontiff! He's not gonna be corrupt, I bet! Ah, Your Holiness. Please forgive the unruly scene. <laughs> Nonsense! The children seem to be enjoying themselves. I mean, this is a Square Enix game. No way in hell the Pontiff won't be corrupt. Or the religion. Right? I mean, it wasn't corrupt in the first game, remember? That's a lie, kind of was in a way, if I remember correctly. <laughs> I pray that is the case. I pray that is the case. I, I actually like, like his voice actor. Come on. Uh, gladly, Pontiff. Temenos. 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 Flame Church. What a weird name for a town. Church in the name of the town. Temenos, does the village seem at peace? It seems decent. It does, at a glance. But shadows lurk around every corner. And that, my son. Is why I have a job for you. Kill them all. We've had no major incidents since I appointed you to the Inquisition. However, no one forgets the Spanish Inquisition. Since arrived, no one remembers. I've felt forces mobilizing against the Church. Hmm. Now I know your position as Inquisitor keeps you plenty busy. But I beg you to aid me, Temenos. I know I can trust you. Just as I trusted Roy. Roy? You shower me with undue praise, Pontiff. Are you two keeping secrets from me? Mint. <laughs> oh, yes, Mint. Grave secrets. Funny, I have I know someone now, with that last name, so I that's how take I knew that way. I, I mean, yes, I know they said the name, but I wasn't paying attention. Come to the cathedral this evening. 
I have much to tell you. Understood, Your Holiness. The truth lies in the flame. Truth lies in the flame. Who was that? I believe that was Lucian, a theologian from the Western Shore. What brings him all the way to meet with the Pontiff, I wonder? Is there no end to the pile of secrets in this place? Hmm. You know, the funny thing is... The cleric, or whatever class I am... I have a little while before my meeting with His Holiness. Perhaps a stroll through the town is in order. Uh... Equipment. Yep, stabs. Here we go. So, Temenos. Alright, let's look at our skills. Alright, yep, he's the white mage, of course. Yeah, cleric. So, he is a... So, cleric. That was the, well, that was the job of... Oh, Odette? Was that her name? I know it started with an O. Or was it Ophelia? Was that Odette or Ophelia? I think it was... Probably was neither of those words. Or neither one of those, um... Ones. But, um... Uh, yeah, uh, it's funny how it, we started with the cleric in, or with the uh, scholar in the first game, but we're ending with him in the second game here. And the cleric is who we're doing now, and the cleric was the one that we ended in the first game. So that's interesting. All right, heal wounds, yep. Holy deal, light-based damage to a single foe, yep. Prayer to the flame, raise the physical defense and elemental defense of a single ally for two turns. Mystical staff, unleash a staff attack on a single foe two times and steal SP equivalent to 10% of the damage dealt. That's not bad. Luminescence, deal light-based damage to all foes, which is going to be pretty good. I think I think what I'm going to do, I want to get these two first. Like These are going to be my first two ones. Sacred shield, grant a shield to a single ally, reducing damage taken from, it, from the next hit by 50%. That's not bad. Revive and revive all allies. Ooh, I can't remember. Was that how it worked in the first game too? Maybe. Okay, question mark, question mark. Resilience. Raises the amount of HP restored to the equipping character when healed. Wait, so that means... That means they have to have this in order to get more HP back when they get healed? Shouldn't it be that the person heals more HP? I don't know. Inner Strength, raise the equipping character's max SP by 50. Evil Ward, increase the party's success rate when attempting to flee. Equipping with multiples will have no added things. Rise again, the equipping character will recover with 25% of their HP once per battle upon being incapacitated. That would be very interesting to have. That's after they get all seven, so. Oh, 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 oh. Yep, that's after they get all seven. All right, I, I don't want to look at anything yet. Like, I don't want to look at the uh, other stuff uh, inside. Like, I don't want to see what his actions are yet. Ah, Inquisitor, we received the directive from the Sacred God. They have asked us to be on guard against the rising numbers of heretics these days. Oh, heretics. As you please memorize the histories of your papers, of your paper plays, Temenos. I can't thank you enough for coming here, Temenos. The church is livelier than ever because of you. The flame bringer's the strongest, without a doubt. I don't care if you make mistakes, Temenos. I still like your paper plays. <laughs> you got skulled by Sister Mint again. <laughs> I like his run. Good afternoon, Temenos. Did the children enjoy today's retelling of the histories? So you're the Inquisitor. For some reason, I thought you'd be much scarier. Whenever I stare at this like this, I feel bloated for some reason. AKA, this is a reason why you won't be going this way. They're all heretics, if you ask me. Every last one of them.
What's the hip happening here? What's all this commotion? Hmm. Listen to me, you fools! The church uses the sacred flame to deceive us. But the truth shall be exposed. The purge begins here and now. Oh, well, that sounds lovely. Open your eyes. The truth lies within all of us. You are the ones who must open your eyes. <sighs> A sanctum knight, are you? Is that Roy? Newly anointed, but yes. Why do you rage against the sacred flame? I beg you, look inside yourself and repent. You didn't say they'd set the knights upon us. Ah! You, you cowards! <sighs> oh? Oh? I'll start the purge with this cleric. That ought to open your eyes. You'll see that the sacred flame protects no one. How dare you? Oh dear. It seems I've been captured. <laughs> oh dear. It seems I've been captured. But while we're here, allow me to ask. You're a heretic, are you not? What? Oh, sacred flame, shine your light upon us. Excuse me? <laughs> Behold, the protection afforded by the sacred flame. Ah, oh, you saved us, Temenos. Ah, you saved us, Thank Temenos. Thank him, not me. Is that the Staff of Judgment? Uh, are you the Inquisitor? That I am. It is an honor to meet you. Only the best among us are chosen to assume the honorable role of Inquisitor. I... I hope to one day join your ranks. Hmm. You're an unusual fellow. Do you have a burning desire to recount our history ad nauseum? Uh, our history? Indeed. What is your name? Crick, sir. I've been assigned to escort duty at the cathedral. Well now, I can certainly vouch for your swordsmanship. And what's going to suck is he's probably going to end up being a boss. If the rumors are true, the heretics are mobilizing against the church. Indeed. The Sacred Guard increases its defenses as we speak. Unbelievable. What are those gods of ours thinking? Peacetime is no time to be lax in your duties. Did I hear you directing those words at the gods? The very gods you inquisitors are messengers for. <laughs> there is such a thing as trusting too much, Crick. I dare say even our gods would be relieved at hearing such a frivolous comment from me. Oh, good. I must be dreaming. These cannot be the words of a clergyman. <laughs> Doubt is what I do, Crick. Uh, if you'll excuse me, I must go greet the pontiff. Then you had better turn around. The cathedral's not that way. <laughs> Please, I've only just been assigned. Goodness, I must admit I fear for you. Come, my little wayward lamb. I shall guide you to the cathedral. W wayward lamb?
Okay, yep. He has the path. So he has, um, he has, um, the path action. Uh, during the day, Tevanos can guide townspeople and they will follow wherever he goes. Yep. So, yes, he has that action like, uh, like Ocheta does with the befriending people that, or, no, yeah, his, yeah, his thing's just basically the same as, um, as Agnia, or Agnia. Oh. Offer your guidance as a cleric and lead a townsperson around. Cannot be used on certain individuals if your level's too low. Right this way. Right this way. Let me your hands, Tamanos. Goodness gracious, only divine punishment awaits those who doubt the sacred flame. What fools they were to doubt you, Tamanos. Can I help you, Inquisitor? I haven't done anything bad, I swear. I'm actually quite interested to know what his nighttime thing is. For some odd reason, I feel like his nighttime thing is going to be asking people for duels. Now the news, Tumnos, you did a fine job, truly. Like, I don't know why. That's how I feel, is that he's going to have the, um... He wants to challenge people at night. All right, maybe he'll have something else. We'll see. Dumb. Hmm. The sun hangs low. We can ill afford to dawdle. The beasts grow in number at night. Then we must steel ourselves and proceed with caution. <laughs> You're a stalwart companion. The Sanctum Knights are handpicked from among the church's best. They're even called God's Blade by some, and reportedly capable of felling a thousand beasts. You may trust me with your life, Temenos. This God's Blade is with you. Hmm. Did my eyes deceive me? During that last fight, I was certain... Yes, I do believe you hid behind me the entire time. What? Why, that's preposterous! I swear on my reputation as a knight, I shall protect you. Then my eyes deceived me, and I meant no disrespect. I hereby place my life in your hands, God's Blade. Very good. You'll not catch me hiding, sir. Now then, let us be off. Okay. Yeah, I'd like to know. Some cleric joined the party. Ah, so now it's now he's actually like a part of the party, quote unquote. Um, because now I don't have to summon him. Hmm. It literally just turned to night. Oh no. Okay. To battle. Very well. Very well. Holy light, illuminate the darkness. To work. Mountain Ape. Okay, so he's Mountain Ape is weak to something else that's magical. Where was I? Could be fire, could be ice, could to be battle. wind, could be anything. Are you all right, Temenos? Crick is already at level four. You overachiever, you. Nah, I don't know. I mean, I don't mind it, but it's like, mm. this little victory fanfare isn't as as I freaking love Ochetas, by the way, and then I also love Agenas and uh, uh, Thor Thorne, Thorne. Now let's not go this way now. Let's 
Let's make our way to the cathedral. I suggest you get out of my way. To battle! <laughs> to battle! Yeah. Oh dear. You son of a bitch. I think not. Where was I? Take that! Well done, Tenemos. Well done, Tenemos. On my honor as a knight. Yeah! It's a knight's duty to fight. That sounds like Johnny Young Bosch's voice actor, but I don't think it is. Like, more so in the battle, I didn't hear it in anywhere else but in the battle quotes there. Let me hear it, like, again in cutscenes. Oh, hey. It's the statue of, of two of the eight. And here we are, my lost lamb. I beg you, cease calling me a lamb of any sort. My name is Crick, and you would do well to remember it. Mm, that's a little bit of Johnny Young Bosch there. Crick. It's a little bit of Johnny Young Bosch I hear. As I said, here we are, the Order of the Sacred Flames Cathedral. Are you quite prepared? This is certainly strange. It's locked. Your Holiness, tis I, Temenos. Hello? Are you in there? Would you be so kind as to open the door? I fear I shall catch a sickness. Didn't you also want to see me? Hello? Did the Pontiff truly invite you here? I must say... I'm beginning to doubt you're the Inquisitor at all. Learn to doubt at last, have you? And yes, he himself told me to meet him here this evening. Perhaps something's gone wrong. How about it, Crick? Can a god's blade with one mighty swing... Cut through the door like a damned criminal? Absolutely not! Oh dear... But, so be it. We'll just have to think of another way to get inside. Hmm. Have you hit upon one? <laughs> hmm? Can you hear me? Uh, Temenos, we'll catch our death out here if we don't think of something. Inquisitor Temenos! Oh, hello there, Crick. <laughs> <sighs> Is everything quite all right? You look dead on your feet. My apologies. I cannot help but concentrate quite deeply when I ponder a problem. <laughs> a bad habit, I admit. <laughs> I'm actually curious about what your uh, nighttime hmm, path action is. Thanks to that bad habit, however, I've thought of something. The cathedral underwent significant repairs two years ago. Surely those who assisted with the repairs still live here. Perhaps interrogating them will shed some light on the way forward. Mm, okay. Interrogating? What are you planning to do to them? Let us be off. What? Am I right that they ch Nah, I don't think challenge it would be right. Let's see. <sighs> At night, Tonos can coerce information out of the townspeople. Oh! So I can... So it's basically... Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. It's basically... Um... Hirar uh... Hikari's nighttime action... But without having to pay money for it, I believe. So it's like, uh, it's, um, it's Casty's daytime action. Exactly. All right. Sounds good to me. 
All right, guys, I think this is actually a good spot to end this part off here, though. So that's going to do it for this part of Let's Play Octopath Traveler 2. In the next part, guys, we will do some coercion and find our way inside the cathedral and see how this first chapter wraps up. Uh, are we going to be fighting the pontiff? Are we going to learn that the church is corrupt this early on? We'll see. All right, guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. Guys, if you liked the video, please give that like button a click. And comment down below if you liked the video, didn't like about the video. And let me know, guys, what do you think of tomorrow? Um, Hold on. How do you say his name again? Tamon. Tamonis. Uh, how do you like his introduction and how he's acted so far? He's very interesting. These characters are like so ba basically the opposite of what the, the their classes were in the first game. And I really like that. It's a nice touch. So, yeah. Let me know how you guys feel about it. And as always, guys, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to the main channel, too. That's in the description below. As well as find me on Twitter, above my main Twitter, the RG Kingdom Kids, where are in there too. And thank you all so much for watching once again. And I will see you all next time.